next guest has been a daytime favourite for you on ITV, oh, for goodness sake, for over two decades, well over two decades. This lunchtime along with her loose women pals, Ruth Langsford's doing what she does best. Let's go, girls. 44% of over 65 say having sex is their favourite favourite activity, followed by gardening. Gardening comes next. Yes! Oh, my nose is running. <laughs> <laughs> I find myself like this. Oh, and I oof. I do a lot of oofing. <laughs> Langsford here and rapping is my thing. You know, at Christmas time, it makes me want to sing. <laughs> I feel like a woman. <laughs> Ruth joins me now. You have too much fun. We have way too much fun. Do you know, sometimes we have so much fun we forget we're on television. That's which is very a bit dangerous. dangerous. It is, because then you never know what you're you know going what it's to like see. You've been on Loose Women and we just chat away like we were with our girlfriends. It's just a blather. Friends. It's just a blather, it's isn't a it? It really is. I mean, obviously, sometimes you have disagreements, but it's, a, it's the power of female friendship which I think is really important. Because we all disagree with our pals now and again, yeah. but then that's that, and you yeah. just get on with it. Well, we just, you know, we have some heated discussions. Heated debates. But we don't fall out. But somehow people just love to pit women against women, don't, don't they? Don't they, though? Because I bet you, if that was a panel of fellas, yeah. you'd never hear any they of that. Go, aren't they malarkey. feisty? Aren't they great? Great yeah. debate. I hate that word, feisty. Yeah. <laughs> so, we, you know, we, we do disagree about things, yeah. but then five minutes later we're laughing, we're talking about something else. So of the best. Of course show. Of course And such a diverse are. group of women, different age groups, different views yep. and opinions on things. I just love it. And actually, so many times I go on that show, I think one thing, and by the end of the discussion, I've changed my mind. See, that's just really good, to other isn't people. it? Yeah. But that's great, yeah. and I think that's why people love to watch, because we, we, we get all those different opinions. Yeah. Then, with all the information, you can make up your own mind. Exactly. You really can. You look fantastic. Stop you it. do. <laughs> how do I've you... used to make up, Lorraine, that's why. <laughs> but how do you say fit and healthy and happy? Well, I try to do a little bit of everything and Maybe. I don't do a lot of much. So I do a little bit of exercise. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> do a little bit of exercise, a little bit of mindfulness-ish, but which is walking my dog, which I know you love your dog. Oh, gosh. Um, but I do like to have fun, you know, and yeah. I, I like to enjoy my life. I like a glass of wine, I like a gin, I like some birthday cake, I like crisps. So I don't want it to take over my life, but the older one gets, yeah. you know, it all starts to just change a little bit, doesn't it? It, and it, moves I think need to, it moves around. It moves around, and that's fine. In places because... I don't want it to move to, yeah. frankly, but yeah. it does. It does. Well, I just try, yeah. You know, I just try and keep on top of it, but not let it take over my life, basically. But you do want to spread the word and help everybody I to do. be the best they can, I guess. Yeah, so I'm doing an event. I'd love you to come. I, it um, sounds brilliant, because called... you've got Rylan there, haven't I've you? Your Rylan, TV son. my TV son. <laughs> I've got Anton, my TV husband-ish, <laughs> second one. Um, so it's called Feeling Fabulous with Ruth. It's in association with QVC, and it's a two-day event. Right. So you can come... Oh, it's a weekend, 23rd, 24th of July, so you can come a Saturday or a Sunday, oh, okay. morning or afternoon. So there's two sessions. Basically, Lorraine, I have created a day out that I would like to have with my girlfriends. Love it. So it's in the most amazing location, old Billingsgate Market, the old fish market. Oh, yeah. Right yeah. next to the Thames, you've got the Shard opposite, you've got Tower Bridge, you've got the Thames, it's beautiful. If it's a lovely day, it'd be stunning. Um, and then it's full of fashion, beauty, lifestyle, retail, celebrity guests, Bubbles Bar, obviously, <laughs> tea and coffee if you want it. And, yeah, and it's a calm... I mean, people have had a tough time, haven't exactly. they? Some it people... sounds like a treat. It's a treat. It's like treat yourself, treat your mum, treat your girlfriend. Treat your girlfriend. Treat your treat daughter. Treat your daughter. <laughs> treat anybody who uh -huh. you love in your life. Maybe people, girlfriends you haven't seen for a while. It's a good chance to get together, come and see some fashion. You can book yourself a free pamper session. There's a lifestyle lounge where people will be looking at mindfulness and yoga. You know, I, I just like to think you'd have a great day out, leave some troubles behind. Yeah. Maybe you'll pick up a tip or two. If you go home with one thing, which is, do you know what, I'm going to take 10 minutes good. for myself, because yeah. I think... Knowing myself and my girlfriends, you're the same, I'm sure. We tend to put ourselves last women. Always. We do everything for bottom everybody of the else. List. Bottom of the list. Always. And so I think if you, if you go away with one piece of information that you say, do you know what, I am going to maybe start to try mm. and go running. I've got Jenny Faulkner coming talking about running. Oh, gosh, I'm she's like a do... gazelle. Isn't she? 
I mean, I did couch to 5K last night, last year, and I kept thinking, in a minute, that I love running jeans nah. need to kick in. It's never going to happen with me, I'm afraid. Didn't. We did that. We did that for Dame Deborah, and I know oh. that you met her at yes, Ascot. I did. Um, and that that photograph, that smile just beaming. I mean, we saw earlier on there was a picture of her for Father's Day yeah. with her dad, and she has got now the stage where her dad's combing her hair because she's not strong enough yeah. to do it. But the strength of her character is, you know, isn't it amazing? Oh, look at that! I love her. Look she's at that. Teeny, her tiny, darling she's dad, teeny tiny. Her darling dad. It was amazing. I mean, obviously, you know her so much better than I do. Uh, it was amazing to see her there. Yeah. To know, you know, we'd all been stressing in the morning, like, oh, is my hat all right? Yeah. And oh, is my lipstick all right? And yeah. you think what it took for her to get out of the house. Incredible. That smile she has literally beams and shines. Oh. She had her hat on, she had her makeup on. I had quite a long chat with her after that photograph was taken, and we talked for quite a long time, actually. And she is the most incredible woman, isn't she? You go away feeling better having met her. It's, a, it's astonishing. You think you're the one that's going to be talking to her and saying, oh, I hope you're all yeah. right, I hope you're OK. She ends up saying, yeah. are you all right? Are you yeah. OK? Oh, how are you doing? And she still has that positivity. I was talking to her about her charity, obviously, which she's oh. done incredibly well. Brilliant, isn't it? And, you know, she just seems to have that spirit, even though she knows she's dying. Yeah. She knows. And yeah. But she just carries on, and oh, it was an absolute honour to meet her. And so lovely to see you, Raymond, out and about. How's he doing? Because I know right. he's had yeah. terrible back problems yeah. and, and all of that, and it must be so difficult. And somehow he smiles through it all. He manages well, to do there. that. Well, he's still had his stick with him because oh. he's got these, these um, protruding discs in his back. Good to see him out But he was out, he's smiling, and it was a beautiful day. We had a great day out. Good. So, yeah. I'm pleased. I'm very, very pleased. It's great to see you. Thank you very much. Good luck with that weekend. It yes. sounds absolutely perfect. It's just like everything is under the umbrella. Everything. And you can just go and, like, you... It's yeah. a treat. Yeah. It's a treat. Well, I'd love you to come. I'd love to come. Send it just sounds... Tickets. I've got... I know people. I'll Do you know people? Go, I know people. <laughs> get your VIP. You know people that know people? Worry. And we'll see you on Loose Women later. I'm on Loose Women later. Yeah, I better get back to my meeting, actually. You better get back to your meeting. I'm sorry to have dragged you out of that. You can go back and get sorted out and I shall sit with a cup of tea and watch you later. Thank you, Thank, Thank you, Ruth. You. Great to see you. Don't forget, you can watch full episodes of Lorraine on the ITV Hub and all the best clips, compilations and playlists right here on our channel. Just subscribe now and you'll never miss an upload. Click here to watch another video similar to this one or click here to head to our channel's homepage to explore all of our exciting videos.